Hey y'all, this is Tasha the Crafty Crout. Um, I think my video stopped, but my machine was causing a bird's nest. Um, so I've taken out my bobbin a million times. I've taken out, I've taken off this whole little device, um, the feeder plate and this little plastic thing. Um, and this is the bobbin, it's the um, bobbin casing. And Somebody I saw online said, well, mate, you know, that could be causing your issue. And I thought, well, I don't think that's true. Sorry for the lighting in here. But anyway, so this has, I don't know if you can see or not, but um, let's see. Right there, right above the little gray part. It's not very focused. There's a little hole. There's a couple little punctures, I, think, I guess, for my needle. Well, I ordered this from um, Amazon. And it's compatible with my machine, and it's a new one of these casings. So I installed it. Um, I used the new bobbin, and I put some thread in, and I just tested it, and it's working. So if you keep getting bird's nest, even if you've cleaned out your bobbin, and you've um, dusted, and you've oiled, and it's still causing the bunched up um, fabric where the um, bobbin's not moving, then I would definitely recommend um, getting a new bobbin casing. And I think it was like eight bucks on um, Amazon. So here's the old one. I'm going to toss it. Uh, the new one looks just the same. I, I don't know how it can work. It, I, I just don't know why it would even not work. But anyways, um, so I just replaced that and it seems like my machine is working again. I really did not want another machine because I don't sew all, all that much. So anyways, just thought I'd share. I have the Brother CS6000 um, little machine. Um, so, and I mean, that's a pretty good machine. It's just a basic machine that has a bunch of different pro, um, different stitches. Um, and it, I mean, it works for what I need and what I use it for. I mean, I just, you know, sew basically straight lines and buttons and zippers. So... I don't need anything super duper fancy. Now I have my embroidery machine over there, which is also a brother. But anyways, thanks for watching. I hope that helps. If anybody has a bobbin issue and you've tried everything, I've taken it out. I've I used a little fuzzy brush. You know, I've used this brush. Where is it? I've used this brush to clean and use the compressed oil and I've oiled it. I mean the compressed air. I've oiled it. I've done everything and nothing works. If all else fails, don't give up. Get a replacement bobbin casing and try and see if that works. So far mine works. So I'm hoping that it will continue. Thanks for watching.